So we're going to use the, the way that we use the pig board is if they're threatening each other and you get control. So that just keeps them from actually attaching. So they're like, you want a piece of me? Yeah, I do, actually. More like, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> and the, get control. Right? The important thing, though, when you're doing this, and it, uh, part, we talked about this a little bit yesterday when we were in the yard, is, is that you have to be able to push the board out that way. A lot of people have the tendency to put their leg in there, right? And if this dog is going and then turns, then your leg is going to get bit. So it's very important to pay attention to where you put your extremities around sharp bitey bits. Give each other a little more work. Um, but yeah, that push in, push in, push in, and move away. Okay, so that's if we can get them to release. Um, as, let's assume that we cannot get a release. So Yona, if she's our third person, has already been like paying attention. What do you need? She's probably yeah. getting a bite stick and water first. So scenario two is there. Matt, we're trying, we're trying. They're latched on. Um, they are not. They're still like. <laughs> Actually, um, at this point, they're usually pretty damn quiet. Yeah. <laughs> um, so water. So water, um, what we're trying to do is have them need to gasp for air. So we're trying to get water in the mouth or in the nose. Um, so that they need to like <gasps> and release and so that we can release them. I'm going to put depression. them on because I'm not letting go, right? I'm also twisting the collar. We're assuming that the one that I'm holding is the biter. That would be a really odd spot to bite. We'll pretend it's there, <laughs> right? Oh, I'm trying not to make it. Yeah. Other way. Other way. Yep. Yep. So and let's turn course. around so everybody yeah. can see that. Yeah. <laughs> right? Not picking the dog back off. So yep. if he's biting the neck, she's going to no, come in, in right there. Twist. So you're going to go behind the canine teeth, right? Swivel in, and it takes some pressure and some time and some experience to get that in there. And then when it gets, you go behind the canine tooth. Twist, 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 and then pop, right? So, so we have the simplest push in, they release, move away. If both of you are moving away to the right, then you're getting the greatest distance right away. Second is um, they attach, they won't water or bucket pour it over them, um, and you want quite a nice volume, and then that, that usually does it, <laughs> if the first one doesn't. And then, more rare cases, is bite stick. I've used person. this once in my life. 